the secret lake. Yeah, you no, said no. 100 yards that way. 300 yards that way, guys. Stay tuned, guys. We're making our way to the secret lake, but as you guys can see, he got a female behind him. He's the ladies, man. My like, guys, the Alphanus. In his mind, nobody can compete with him. He is that iguana. He's been fighting and scruffling. He finally got dethroned. Then we got this other lazy iguana that was taking a nap in the tree. Wrong place, wrong time, buddy. If you look right down there, you see that uh, orange thing? Yeah. It might look like an iguana, but I think it might be a cone. But it just goes to show, you always have to have your eyes peeled. Speaking of that, guys, we are in the middle. Oh my gosh. Oh, wow. We might have to that guy. You ready, Richard? Yes. Yes, I am. Let's go see if we can put him in the bag. Oh, yes. Special shout outs to FX Air Guns and Paramount Air. Oh, my God. Oh. Hyper orange. Oh. Oh. Ooh. The finesse. The finesse. <laughs> my goodness. My goodness. Oh dog. my gosh. Definitely. Six foot. What's your name, bud? Richard Ross. From Tennessee. Yeah, I've been watching your videos, I don't know, a couple years. Chance, well, she wants to come and observe. Like three or four alphas right now being. I don't know what they're doing, but yeah, let's uh, we're gonna we're gonna be basically like walking stalking, you know. Okay. Buddy Richard said he said he might be throwing some on the grill, so y'all gonna have to stay tuned for that. That female that we uh, we didn't get the other day. We got the big male from here the uh, other day. This might be that female. Hey! Wow! Almost <laughs> We got you. I heard you say female? It's a female iguana, yeah? Yeah, we don't want female. Yeah. Last night. I'm like, where'd he go? <laughs> He's in the bag. But no. Where's this ice water mom to do this? taught me how to catch iguanas. Yeah. 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 Yeah, exactly. Same same exact thing. I'm gonna try to go around this way so I don't scare the iguana. Big ones everywhere. Calm down. It's okay. Wow. It's all right. This whole time he was sitting there like a rock, dude. So we put that snare on him and he just went berserk. But he's breeding. Yeah. yeah. Because we have this big male. Yeah. And there's this big female. Wow. Completely unfazed. Look at that. She's like, what are Richard, you, you ready to get that female? Yeah. She's not even concerned. Let's put it right on him. Let's uh, get this guy backed up. Let's compose ourselves, guys. There's iguanas all over the secret lake. We'll be right back. All right, see if we can put more in the bag.
You're on him. You're on him. There it is. Yep, nice and easy. Easy peasy, lemon squeeze. Dude, some of these iguanas got hops, bro. <laughs> they definitely like basketball for the iguana league. Oh my gosh, dude. Got it. That's awesome, bro. You did succeed. Very sweet. Thank you. That's it, bro. Charlie, you're right. You got you got yourself a nice little uh, iguana entree right here, y'all. Yeah, nice female. Yeah, look at that. This is, is a very, female. This is a female. This is a good one to eat right here. You get that nice, nice tender iguana fillet right there, man. Mm, that sounds good, man. Let's go ahead and bag this one up. Um, the secret lake. Uh, he says like, he, yeah, no, he no. said 100 yards that way. Yeah. 300 yards that way, guys. Stay tuned, guys. We're making our way to the Secret Lake. But as you guys can see, uh, me and Richard, we're taking out some of these breeders out of the ecosystem. <laughs> you got, coming uh, here, so. Oh, we got a nest right here. Yeah. And that big alpha right there. That's probably the big bad boy cleaning this, uh, this whole lake. Yeah. He did tell us it was a big one that way. Yeah, he did. All on these trees. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, we got one in the tree right here. Like that. Just try to finesse the pole. Maybe he's right there on that. Oh, I see him. Oh, no, you gotta pull him back. You gotta set the stair. Hold on one second. Oh, there it is. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> well, that's when we had to wake up in Iguana. <laughs> you got a big house we came out here trying to get some iguanas then we started talking to some golfers then they told us about a mysterious lake guys and i think we have found it right now we're gonna hunt this lake see what alphas and other iguanas we can dethrone put in the bag and uh keep it rolling there is a oh my gosh uh got a red one in the tree we got an orange one on the ground got an orange one right there we got a big another red one all right, here, here's what, bro. Let me see this right quick. Come with me, all right? Now come with me through these bushes. We're gonna sneak up on that alpha. You're gonna put this snare on him, and then we're gonna put him in the bag. How does that sound? Sound like a plan. Sound like a plan? All Sounds right. Sounds like lunch. Sounds like <laughs> lunch? Okay. Let's see if we can do it. Not do that again. We'll grab him right there and we'll seal the deal. Great job, man. Oh, nice. <laughs> He's got spikes on him too. Thank you. It's a little tricky, right? No, yeah. it's it's tricky, man. But you know, like I said, you were you had to give up. You were gonna get this iguana no matter what. Well, he was lazier than I am, so he just stayed there. Yeah, sometimes it'd be like that, and it works out yeah. to our advantage. He's been. Well, uh He figured he's bigger and better than I am. He's not phased by you, right? He's not, he's not phased by you. You're, we're in no. his territory and he's looking at us like, oh, all right, next. What else? What do you see? I don't know, but I don't know if you guys seen him when you caught him, but he had battle wounds. Really? Yeah. One here on his leg. Oh, yeah. On his stomach. Oh, man. On his leg. But the whole yeah, time while we yeah. was catching him, that big red one was sitting up in the tree, too. Yeah. Yeah. So, as you guys know, since it's breeding season, there could be more than one big orange alpha in the area. Just like DJ said, and he's just showing you guys right here, there is proof of battling for dominancy. See that right there? Big chunk of flesh just came out. That looks like when you look a couple of weeks old. Yeah. So they're, they're fighting out here, man. They're fighting out here. They're scrapping. They're getting ready to breed. 
Guys, we're at the secret lake. Stay tuned, we're gonna bag this guy. See if we can get another one. In the back. In the back. All right, real quick, just wanna show you guys what we accomplished. You guys seen those two that we got back over there? We just grabbed this giant alpha that's been the, the warrior. The last couple of weeks, he's been fighting and scruffling. He finally got dethroned. Then we got this other lazy iguana that was taking a nap in the tree. Wrong place, wrong time, buddy. If you look right down there, you see that uh, orange thing? Yeah. It might look like an iguana, but I think it might be a cone. But it just goes to show, you always have to have your eyes peeled. Speaking of that, guys, we are in the middle. Oh, my gosh. Oh, oh. wow. Ooh. We might have to keep going, that guy. Wow. If that isn't a, a sure tail signs of him showing his dominance, guys, I don't know what is. I think he's trying to bully that other iguana. You've been a bad, bad iguana. You ready, Richard? Yes. Yes, I am. Let's go see if we can put him in the bag. Oh, yes. All right, guys, we're going after him. There he is right there. The big bad alpha. Just walk straight. Yeah. Just keep walking straight. Oh shoot. Yeah, there goes the spread for now. Nice five piece iguana nuggets. Nice. Males, alpha males. Wow. You see them up there, right? Oh, wow. Real quick, I just want to show you guys a little bit of the devastation and damage that iguanas can cause. Obviously, they can kind of erode your canal banks. Stuff, you know, make holes and just dig. But then also, interesting, yeah, there's a bunch of them in this tree. What they can do, guys, is, is some of these branches. Yeah. You see how some of these limbs are kind of like pushed out? Yeah. Instead of growing straight up? I, I wonder if that's from iguanas, dude. If maybe like the weight of iguanas at some point Push it down. kind of like messed up like the growth trajectory of the tree. Not 100% sure, guys. Let me know in the comments down below what you think. Maybe like a monkey. Where's he at? Where'd that monkey at? Right there. On top? Oh, wow. Oh, my gosh. There's one right down there at the at the bottom of that. Right there. Dude, this place this place is full of alphas. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This place is full of alphas, dude. Dang, son. Dang. And these are all big 12-pounder, 12 12-plus 12 pounders. Speaking of Jurassic Park. Josh. Telling you, you don't even got to go to Hollywood to film a Jurassic Park movie. Just come out here to Florida. Come with us. Show you guys the real. Oh my! <laughs> Are you ready? <laughs> oh my gosh! Wow, those seem like a group of females. Look at that. There's one right there at that bank too. Look how they're just. You're right. There's so many different colors of them. There's so many different color iguanas. Just the alphaness right there is just like it's insane, guys. Another one right there. They're just that one looks super orange, though, bro. Yeah, that's the beast. See the female one crawling up to him? Mm hmm. She likes that, man. He got a female behind him. He's the ladies, man. Big bad orange iguana. of that iguana guys the alphaness in his mind nobody can compete with him he is that iguana who's that iguana it's yeah. him he is that alpha Oh my god, it is a dinosaur. Oh. 
fearlessness of this iguana sees me coming right up to him big bright orange like a safety cone hey how many of you guys snag her right so far huh uh yeah wow <laughs> wow is this the same one that we've seen that was uh being alpha across the lake when yeah we first came here yeah the silly iguana he saw us caught his friends Never learned his lesson. Birds cannot describe how happy I feel right now to successfully apprehend the iguana of this caliber. The colors, the size, the head structure, the spikes, the dewlap, the ferocity, and the arrogance of this alpha male is truly legendary, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed the show. We're gonna go ahead and wrap it up right here with this last one. Yeah. Yeah, you Puerto Rican? I'm Trinidadian. Trinidadian? Yeah. yeah. Okay. yeah. You had it in Puerto Rico, that was a big thing, man. That's everybody ate iguana. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So yeah. That's cool. Get rid of those first banders. <laughs> hey, we can't beat them, we gotta eat them, right? <laughs> in the bag. <laughs>